Hi friends. So today what we are going to do is we are going to make a 3D dog. So let's see the supplies that we need. We need um, a white paper. So um, we are taking the whole paper. Okay. We also need a black marker. It doesn't have to be a permanent marker. It can be any black marker. We need scissors, some type of glue, a pencil. Okay. So in case um, you, I'm going to make a white and black spotted dog. In case you are making a brown spotted dog, uh, you can use the marker set. Okay. So let's uh, see the steps. So first, what we're going to do is we are going to cut out a square paper. So for that, we are going to take one corner of this paper uh, and then match this side. Bring this down over here, such a way that this uh, side matches with this side. So, can you see? This side of the paper matches this side. So bring this corner down in such a way this part matches this part. Make a nice crease. I'm going to cut out the excess. So we will need these for making other things. So I'm going to set that aside for now. And now what I'm going to do is I'm going to place the paper this way. Okay. And over here, what we're going to do is um, we are going to put three fingers like that, okay, next to the, so this is the side that opens, this is the folded side. So three fingers, then four fingers, then three fingers, okay. Now what we are going to do is from this point, we are going to make a, like a, make a straight line. Then go like that, straight line. Okay. Then here, I'm going to go to here. And then from here, I'm putting a dot, like one finger space and dot. I'm going to make a line like that. Okay. Maybe four finger space here. So now we're going to take the scissors. And we are going to cut this. Maybe height of this it doesn't matter. Cut on the line. I want the line to show, so I'm going to cut the line off. So these things you can use for making the eyes. So right now, for the dog's eyes, I'm going to put this one on top of each other. Draw a circle. And then cut that out. Okay. Or you could uh, draw that directly on the paper, but I prefer to draw the eyes. I'm going to make a circle and a semi-circle or a rainbow around that. Oh, 
going to color this in except the circle this little circle same thing with this one this part I need to cut that off <clears throat> next what we're going to do is we are going to fold this like that to the other side open it Fold it upwards. The, if you want the tail to stay like this towards the body, you can put it that way. Or Next, what we are going to do is the excess piece is there, right? We're going to take that. Let me see. We open it this way. It is too close to the thing. Let's fold it the other way. Like that. Hmm. Now, next thing, let's fold the bottom like that. So it's like one inch fold. Not one inch, like one finger width fold. Fold. Now fold this to this side. So it's like that, like a feet. Okay. This one. This way. So your doggy can stand like that. Okay. Now let's get this paper. Fold it. What I'm going to do is you're going to draw a U shape. almost touching the edge of the paper okay cut it out so this is the folded part we made the thing like that now these this piece is there right so let's use that piece and if there is any other leftover piece let's draw the ears or you can just use this much and then make a ears this way It's like a drop, U, and connected by a V on top. Can you see that? So this, if you want, if you're going for a black and white dog, you can 
color this uh, ears black so that it will stand out more. If it is a uh, brown and I will go for a brown and uh, white dog. So I'm going to take my brown uh, paper, no, not the brown marker, and I'm going to color the ears brown. also make spots on your dog so that it will look like it is a spotted dog so maybe draw a shape and then make an irregular shape okay not a, a like a, an organic shape not a shape that you use in math like a circle or things like that Whatever you want, you can go ahead and put spots. Okay. I'm going to take the glue stick and then I'm going to glue down the eyes first. Let's glue down his ears. So this part downwards. Oh, look at this fella. Now. should have been a little bit bigger right hmm, maybe I'll put it up here so what I'm going to do is I'm going to put the glue because if I just leave it like this it is going to fall right so instead I'm going to lift this up a bit and then glue so only glue on the bottom side and then right here I'm going to glue so this much is sticking up okay two finger space and then fold because it's not standing properly so fold it really well make a nice crease 
then open it and the other one you are going to fold backwards same thing open fold backwards and then when you put the feet down oh here you can put some glue for the tail to stick up your doggy would stand see how it's standing over here but you won't be able to see from how i'm um, taking the video i will show you how it's standing uh, in a different spot okay so this is our finished work hope you guys enjoyed making this cute little puppy with me i had a lot of fun so till we meet next time Bye-bye.